I'm just going to give you a couple of names of fighters, just quick thoughts. Justin Gaethje. I think I beat him again. I think I set traps, hit him with good shots, uh, let him do half the work, being the wrecking ball and juggernaut that he is. Uh, let him be that guy, and I'll be the matador. I think I can do, the, do it again, as I did in the first fight. But we'll see. He's fighting Khabib next. I think he has the wrestling credentials to give Khabib a lot of trouble. If he can st stick to the game plan and keep his back off the fence, keep his feet away from the fence, and make it happen in the center of the octagon, if it happens there, I think he's going to win this fight. Interesting. Tony Ferguson. All heart, man. All heart. I think his technique and his uh, rhythm – and his cadence is, is off. It's, it's, it's unusual. It's unusual timing. His movements are, are unorthodox. Uh, he makes a lot of mistakes, but his belief in himself carries him through a lot of tough situations. And last one, Nate Diaz. A fighter's fighter. Uh, you know, I don't know the guy personally. We, we've had it, you know, words over social media before. Uh, we were supposed to fight once. But every time he fights, I'm going to tune in. And uh, there's something magnetic about his fighting style that is why he has the fan base and uh, that he has. But I I'd love to fight him.